Hello everyone, welcome back to our YouTube channel. Today I will show you how to perform before save operations using flows in Salesforce. A before save flow is a trigger that is performed before an operation, such as an insert, update, delete, etc. You can use the before save flow to check or change values before data is updated or inserted in the database. Before save flow is much faster because each record does not get saved to the database again. Use before save flow when you want to update fields on new or changed records, which means that you want to update the fields on the record that started the flow. Now, let's create a simple flow that will copy the account's billing address automatically when creating and updating an order. To create a flow, first go to setup. Now search for flow in the quick find box and click on it. Now click on the new flow. Select record triggered flow and then click on create. Now under objects, search for order. In configure trigger section, select a record as created or updated. In the condition requirements, select any condition is met or. Now new fields will automatically appear below. In the field, select ID. In the operator, select is null. And in value, select global constant true. Click on add condition to create more conditions. In the field box, type account ID. And in the operator, select is change from the list. In value, select global constant true. And then click done. Now, from the elements section, drag and drop the assignment to the screen. In the label, type the name of your assignment. For example, I am typing copy account address to order. Now, in set variable values, in variable, select record, then billing street. In the operator, select equals. And in the value box, search for record, then select account ID, and then select billing street. Now do the same above step for the field's billing city, billing state, billing postal code, and billing country. After that, click on Done. Then join the Start with Assignment. Then click on Save. Here type in the name of Flow. And then click Save. Now, click on Activate button. Now let's check whether our flow is working or not. To check, go to the App Launcher and search for Order and click on it. Then click on New at the top right and fill in the required fields. You can see that I am not filling in the billing address fields like, Billing Street, Billing City, etc. because they will auto-populate when the record gets saved. After that, click on, Save. And go to the detail page and scroll down, and here you can see the billing address has been saved. So, that's it for this video. See you soon in the next video. Please like, share, and subscribe to our YouTube channel. Don't forget to click the bell icon to get the new update. Thanks for watching.